Hey everybody, this is Eric Worre and welcome to NetworkMarketingPro.com. Inviting prospects is one of the most important skills that you need to develop. And at our recent GoPro Recruiting Mastery event, we did three hours just on this skill. How to invite people using a direct approach, using an indirect approach, using a super indirect approach. There's an eight step process to inviting and that sounds like it's a lot but it's not um, and one of the things we did is we did a lot of role playing at this event and what I meant by that is we we teamed people up in pairs and we had them practice we we taught them a lesson we taught them an approach how to do it and then we had them practice the approach and then after that I asked them how did it feel and in today's show, I want you to hear, I'm going to, I'm going to take some clips from that just to hear how it felt for them to, as a prospect, when they were role playing and one of them was being a prospect, how did it feel as a prospect and how did it feel as a distributor? And the first approach that we had them practice was a direct approach. I have an opportunity for you. Okay. They used a direct approach with, um, you know, somebody that they knew. And we had them pair up, and I want you to hear some of the comments after, immediately after that session and what people felt like through the process and what they learned through the process. So check that out. Okay. Tell me some things that you learned during that exercise. Easy. Natural. Comfortable. The more you practice, the better you get. What? Effective. It works around the world, in every culture, with every company. I've rarely found a process that will actually do that. This actually does. It doesn't just sound good. It actually works in real life. No question. Those of you who were being the prospect, how did it feel? Professional? Comfortable? Did you feel honored? Did you feel complimented and respected? Did it feel overall, did it feel good? Isn't that interesting? The fact that they felt great. The prospect felt amazing. That it felt simple. That it felt comfortable. And this is after just five minutes of, you know, they've learned for an hour. But then five minutes of practice and all of a sudden they went, wow, I guess I could do this. Um, the second exercise that we did, and we did exercise the whole weekend, but the second exercise specifically that I want you to listen to is an indirect approach. We had them use an indirect approach as if they were approaching a family member or a close friend. And um, what they felt like and what they learned after that. So check out what they had to say immediately after their second role-playing session. <laughs> All right, give me some insights of what you, what you observed during this last ex exercise. Yeah. Huh? Say again. It's getting easier. We've only done it a couple times. And it's already getting easier. Yes. You can already stray from the script a little bit and you still have the basic flow and concept. You can say your own words, can't you? Yeah. You build a connection with that person in a very short period of time. You, it, 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 it is an instant rapport builder. Yes. As a prospect, you want to help. It's kind of like when a person comes up and says, can you give me directions to the church? person wants to give directions if they know them. Right? It's that kind of feeling, isn't it? You're helping out your fellow person. Yes. Less stress. You have structure, right? And it's comfortable, and you know that they're feeling good about it. Yes. Feels confident. You still got to practice. Yep. It's almost like a game. It's fun. It's like a social experiment. There's no good experiences, no bad experiences, just learning experiences. 
You did this with strangers. You knew it was a game. And yet, when you were the prospect, how did you feel? Good. You knew it was a game and you still felt good. When they don't know it's a game, how do you think they're going to feel? Good. Yeah. You're not afraid of a no. Because did anybody, did it feel natural to throw a no into any of the processes when you were doing it? Completely unnatural. Somebody who throws a no into that is an unreasonable person. <laughs> doesn't make sense. It just doesn't make sense to throw a no in. So, are you starting to see a recurring theme? Their confidence is growing. They're feeling better about themselves. They're going, oh my gosh, I didn't have to be afraid of this. I don't have to be scared uh, of this process. Um, the third thing I had them do is, is do a super indirect approach where they were talking to somebody very influential, very high level person. So after they were done with that role play, check out what they had to say there. Okay, give me some insights, some things you learned from that exercise. Easy to go after influential people, isn't it? Yes. Lots of compliments. Yeah, yeah. Even though, even though you know it's a game. When you say it's not for you, it's human nature to go, I'll be the judge of that. You just hold on a second. Yeah. When you know what you're going to say, you can concentrate on your passion and your posture and your energy, and you don't have to worry about the words so much. Yeah. High powered prospects feels in control. This this takes care of their ego in a way. They get complimented. So again, what you get is this recurring theme of wow, I can do this. I can talk to a super influential person. I can I'm not limited to my, you know, only talking to people who look up to me. I can talk to people that I look up to. Again, it's liberating, and this this type of practice cannot be over overemphasized. It's so important for you to practice this skill of inviting. And the other thing I did is I asked them to take out a couple of the steps, a couple of the first steps of the eight-step invitation process, and do the exact rest of the 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 process just to feel if they if they mess up just a little bit, they pull a little bit out what that feels like. And you'll be shocked that if you just adjust this little formula a tiny little bit, everything changes. So you're going to go from hearing how great it was to hearing how kind of miserable and, and not good feeling it was. So check out the feedback after I have them. Just take out a couple steps and do the rest of the invitation exactly the same way. All right, stop there. Stop there. What difference, how much of a difference is there? It's uncomfortable, isn't it? For everybody. The prospect feels attacked. This is what you've been doing. You feel the difference? It's cold, it's ugly, it's barren, it's... You don't want to be that person on either side. As a prospect, how did you feel? Uncomfortable. As a distributor, how did you feel? Like you were pushing. As a prospect, you feel attacked. All we added was 30 seconds of niceness. And then we said the same words. And that's something. Part of this weekend is I want you to feel this. Because when you, you, you just felt how good it can feel. And now you got to experience how bad it can feel with the same words. Interesting. Right? Okay. I'm excited for you. Isn't that fascinating? It was such a big eye-opener for people in the room to realize, oh my gosh, this is what I've been doing. My whole career, I've been using this approach 
No wonder I feel bad. No wonder people run away from me. No wonder people aren't joining my business because they, I feel like a predator and they feel like they're being hunted. My gosh, if I could just do this professionally, I'll be able to have a better result. I'll be able to have the results that they were feeling in the first role-playing exercises. Uh, so I wanted to get you an idea that if you do this right, you're going to feel great. If you do it wrong, you're going to feel bad. I don't want you to feel bad, and I do want you to feel great. So clearly we can't go through the whole three hours on, on uh, Network Marketing Pro here. That's why we created the home study course. That's why I want you to get it. That's why we priced it so low that you can get the entire 20 sessions of the home study course in video and in audio, including all of these role play exercises, including the script book that we use in the weekend. And you can also get two tickets to the next event, the GoPro Recruiting Mastery event for free. It's like $1,500 value that you can get for $197. So I, you know, my wish for you, really, if you want to start stop feeling bad and start feeling good all the time, get that home study course and start practicing. Work with some people right away, practice, get great, because you deserve it. Your business deserves it. So go to the link below, go to the link over here, go pro, uh, networkmarketingpro.com forward slash recruiting, any way you want to get there, go get your hands on that home study course. If you're not happy with it for any reason, just let us know. We'll give you your money back. So it's not really even a risk here. We've reduced it down as low as we possibly can so everyone, and I want everyone inside the Network Marketing Pro community to get this value. It's the best thing, the best work I've done in 25 years. I want, to get, want you to get your hands on it. So, ladies and gentlemen, my wish for you is that you decide to become a network marketing professional. You decide to go pro. You decide to feel good all the time and help other people do the same because it is a stone-cold fact that we have a better way. Now let's go tell the world. Everybody have a great day. We'll see you tomorrow. Take care. Bye-bye.